Courtney and Carlos, it is a really sad situation over here. As you mentioned, 17 cats were killed when a massive fire broke out at this shopping center. And you can see the tremendous damage left behind. Many of these businesses are completely unrecognizable. And firefighters have been out here. They've been clearing away all of this debris that you see and also conducting an investigation. They were out here for close to 12, 13 hours today. And you can see there are seven businesses here impacted by both smoke and fire damage and one of them is of course the pet boarding facility. This happened on West Venice Boulevard around 545 this morning. We know that one firefighter was injured by the intense heat and was taken to the hospital for observation. The direct fire damage was limited to five adjoining businesses, a nail salon, a smoke shop, a martial arts studio and also the pet hotel, a jewelry store and a restaurant were also damaged. There were several cats, thankfully, that survived the fire. They are being housed at another pet hotel called Cat Place LA on Venice Boulevard. All seven of these businesses were under the same roof, and the cause of the fire right now is still under investigation. We did speak to one of the business owners here. He owns the tobacco shop. He told us he lost everything. I'm feeling very bad. I've been working for two years, seven days. I lost everything, you know. I work hard, it's, it's gone everything. Let's see what's going on, insurance and everything. I don't know anything, you know. Right now, my mind is not good right now. I'm very upset, you know. And like many business owners, Mohammed tells us that he's working with his insurance company right now, but that he has lost everything that he has built over the last two years. As far as the traffic in this area, police just reopened the westbound lanes on Venice and Culver Boulevards as investigators start to wrap up their investigation. We're live in Palms. I'm Rachel Menatoff, KTLA 5 News.